Hey Google, turn on some coffee music. Playing the album coffee music on Spotify. Good morning everyone. We have been having a really cold winter here in California and we have this feral cat. We adopted her, we brought her in. She doesn't let anybody touch her or anything. So she sleeps outside, she's fixed. We don't have to worry about cat babies, but it's been really cold outside. So I think today's project is gonna be to build her a house. But first, gotta have that coffee. Because the day does not start until you have coffee. Okay, so to start this project, first we gotta measure. So one of the things that got me motivated to start building my own furniture is, is the fact that you can measure and be able to fit things perfectly wherever they're gonna go. You go to a retail store, you might find what you're looking for, but it's never gonna fit perfect. And if you learn how to build stuff on your own, you'll have better luck of having things fit a little bit better. So this is the temporary house that I made for her and she loves it. She does go in there so I know she feels comfortable in there. So what we're going to do now is we're going to build her a nicer home, a little bit more roomy for her and we can rest assured that she's going to go in there and sleep in it because that's where she's been. So let's start measuring. 16 inches, a foot, and 18 inches inside. Now let's go to my favorite store. Home Depot. I can feel my body fold against the concrete, but I can't seem to get enough. My mind is fixed on what it wants. I just let you beat me, look at me deceiving. Let you get the best of me, but with my worst enemy. This is a no go. I just can't take cold. This is a danger zone. Back up and get me home. This is a no go. I just can't take cold. This is a danger zone. Alright, so we got our measurements and I did a drawing. Doing the drawing ahead of time is good. That way you have an idea of what the house is going to look like. We know that she needs an 8x8 doorway to get inside. And we know that the width is going to be 24 and the height is 16. Now the roof I'm not quite sure. The roof is what gives the house a lot of character. But I'm not sure if I want a square roof or a flat roof or a pointed roof. I'm not sure yet. So that we're gonna experiment as we go. But we know the overall measurements of the house. Nico, do you have your measurements of the house? Um, right here. Show me what they are. It's it's gonna be two feet wide. Mm-hmm. It's gonna be um, 16 inches tall and the door is going to be 8 inches. So now that we got our drawing, we're going to simply draw it on the piece of plywood and start cutting. side or the roof I decided to just go with the flat roof with a little downfall I thought it gave it a bit more of a modern look but you can do any type of roof you want so I have the front I have two sides and then the back what I'm gonna do next is I like to give everything a nice little sand down just to make everything smooth and look pretty <laughs> All right, now that I have all my pieces together, I'm gonna to start assembling and I'm gonna use glue and my finish nailer for that. Now 
now that I got the base shell put together, I'm going to reinforce it a little bit stronger with this 1x2. I'm going to cut pieces for each of these corners to put inside and that will make the whole box a lot stronger. Motion, trying to control my thoughts, but I can't stop a box All right, now that we got the main box, we're gonna do, we're gonna work on the roof. The roof is really simple, it's just gonna be a square, but we're gonna give it a one inch overhang on each side. We're gonna give it one inch overhang all around. So if this measures 24 inches, we're gonna make sure we have an inch of overhang over here and an inch of overhang over here. So total will be 26 inches. So that looks good, the roof is on. I bought two hinges, so I'm gonna install those in the back because I want the roof to be able to open. That way I can change the bedding whenever necessary. All right guys, so the roof has been installed. It could open, that way you could change the bedding as needed. This is the main structure. This is the main skeleton of the house. Anything else you do from here on out is pure aesthetics, have fun with it. Feel free to follow what I do or you could do your own stuff as well. So to start dressing it up, I'm going to start with this thick piece of trim that I found and I'm going to put I'm going to put a border all around the top of it. Now that I finished now that I finished putting the top trim, I'm gonna put some of this corner oak trim that I have laying around. And that's gonna be for these corners right here just to clean everything up. So all the trim has been added. Now comes the really fun part and that's to paint it. Again, this is where you can have fun. You don't have to follow what I do. Alright guys, for the roof, I'm using this, I believe it's called shingle edging or roof edging. Basically what it is, it's like roof shingles, but it has a sticky back so you just peel it and it'll it'll stick on. You don't, you don't even need nails. So I believe that's what it's called. I just had it laying around. I can't even remember when I actually used this, but yeah, it's, it's uh... It's, it's made like roofing shingles. It has the materials of roofing shingles, but it's like, a, it's like a sticker. So you just peel this, you just peel this, and this sticks to the roof. I don't think I need nails, but, you know, let's see.
Okay, I'm pretty much done. Now it's time to go put it outside. But first I want to see if Mousy's there. I don't want to scare her away. Oh, there she goes. It's as if she knows that I'm filming and she doesn't want to be on camera. So now that she's out, let's go ahead and put the house in place. Right, guys that concludes the end of this project I really hope Mousy likes it I really like how it came out it's nice and cozy she's right over there waiting for me to leave so hopefully we'll catch her coming in but don't forget to like and subscribe the video I'll see you guys next time peace